These are the faces of America's missing. Every 30 seconds, another child, a sister, a brother, a father, mother disappears. Families left behind, wondering, waiting, hoping. We have not forgotten. Jamie Harper was last seen on Saturday morning, March 10th, 2007. It was about 4.30 a.m. Jamie went to a party the night before and made plans to spend the night at a friend's house. Jamie, who was 20 at the time, never arrived, and she never returned home. It was not clear if Jamie left the party alone. A few dozen investigators combed the area and used dogs in their search for Jamie. The FBI has also taken on the case. Detective Sergeant Marcus Beach, the Rantoul Police Department in Rantoul, Illinois. We know that she was at that party for several hours uh, with several people uh, at the party. During the night at some point, uh, she left the party and uh, has, hasn't been seen since. Well, she went with a, a friend of hers that she had known for a while, and she went to the party. He picked her up uh, from her mother's residence there in Paxton, and they went to the party. He stayed at the party longer. She left uh, before he did. That's where uh, the stories conflict between uh, we've done multiple interviews of people at the party and that's where the stories are starting to conflict as to who she left with and when that's one of the key areas that we've focused on are, are the people that were at the party and trying to uh, put together a timeline we have some uh, key people of interest that uh, we've looked at from what we hear she was uh, she was a good girl you know she has every teenager and uh, early 20s person had had difficulties in life at times, but you know, she all together was a, was a good girl. She had a job, she had gone to school and, and was, was doing well. When she disappeared, Jamie was five feet tall, weighing 130 pounds. She has brown hair, brown eyes, and a tattoo on her lower back and a nose ring. She was last seen wearing blue jeans, a white jacket, sandals, and carrying a black handbag.